In this video, I will explain the requirements you must meet in order to be eligible to sit for the CPA exam and be licensed as a CPA in Arkansas. So, keep watching! Hey future CPAs, this is Ala Abudaya. I'm a licensed CPA in the state of Colorado and I help students pass the CPA exam and become CPAs. If this is your first time here and you're interested in becoming CPAs, start by subscribing to our channel and clicking the bell in order not to miss any of my videos. To qualify to apply to sit for the CPA exam in Arkansas, there are certain requirements you must meet. Comment below and tell me if you are planning to apply to our Arkansas State Board of Accountancy to sit for the CPA exam. Now, Arkansas does not have any age or citizenship or residency requirements to sit for the CPA exam. So, there are no age requirements, no citizenship requirements, and no residency requirements. However, Arkansas requires you to have a United States social security number. That's why this jurisdiction may not be suitable for international candidates who want to sit for the CPA exam. If you want other state options that are suitable for international candidates, watch this video which I named some good states for international candidates as well. Now, to be eligible to sit for the CPA exam in Arkansas, you must have a minimum of a bachelor degree with at least 120 credit hours by a degree-granted accredited college or university in the United States. If you studied outside the United States, then you must send your academic credentials for evaluation by NASPA, International Evaluation Services, or any other acceptable evaluation provider. Your education must include a minimum of 30 hours of accounting related subjects in upper level advanced courses or 20 graduate hours or a combination of both. These courses must cover the following six subjects. Number one, financial accounting. Number two, cost or managerial accounting. Number three, governmental or non-for-profit accounting. Number four, federal taxation. Number five, auditing and attestation. And six, accounting information systems. Does that make sense? Comment below and tell me if you need these educational requirements or not. So these are the requirements to apply to sit for the CPA exam in Arkansas. This state also allows you to sit for the CPA exam in any place in the United States or internationally. So you can sit outside the United States as well. Concerning the licensing requirements, they are different from the CPA exam requirements. Watch this video to learn the difference between the CPA exam requirements and the CPA licensing requirements. To be licensed in Arkansas State, you must meet the 3 E requirements and not the 4 E as required by most states. Since this state does not have any ethics exam requirement, so you have to meet only the 3 E requirements, which are E number 1, education. Arkansas requires you to have 150 credit hours to be licensed and not 120 hours as required to sit for the exam. Now, if you don't meet the 150 hour requirement and you are wondering how to fulfill the 150 hour requirement, make sure to watch this video, which I gave you great options to help you meet the 150 hour requirement. E number two you must meet for licensing is passing the four parts of the CPA exam. To learn the four parts of the CPA exam, watch this video. And to get my best tips and tricks to pass the four parts of the CPA exam, make sure to watch these four videos, which I give you great tips and advice to pass the far part of the exam, the audit part of the exam, the break part of the exam, and the BEC part of the exam. 
And finally comes the third E you must meet, which is the experience. You must have at least one year of experience with a minimum of 2,000 hours in public or non-public accounting verified by a licensed CPA. This experience can be gained through employment in government, industry, academia, or public practice, providing any type of services or advice involving the use of accounting, attest, management advisory, financial advisory, tax, or consulting skills. Comment below and tell me if you meet the three E requirements or not for licensing purposes in Arkansas. To learn how to apply for the CPA exam and schedule the exam, get my free CPA exam application cheat sheet from the link in the description below. It is totally free and it gives you the steps you must follow to apply and schedule your CPA exams. So make sure to get this free application cheat sheet from the link below. My next video will be about Washington CPA exam requirements. So make sure to subscribe to this channel to get this video. Remember, go after what you want, pass the CPA exam because you can become CPAs and save the world.